Hi, my name is Dan and I'm one of the DT evangelists here at Digital Tutors. In this video, we're going to look at a question from one of our users on how to smooth out a render that is utilizing global illumination. So to illustrate this, I have a scene from the Introduction to Mental Ray in Maya course. Now, if I were to just go ahead and render this out, we can see in the resulting render, we're getting some uh, noisy artifacts here on the wall. Uh, in this particular case, also getting this hot spot here in the ceiling. Now, the noise that we're seeing actually is coming from the photons being cast into our scene. They're not really being smoothed out enough. Now, to fix this, we could come into our render settings and try to increase the accuracy or even bump up the count of the overall photons that we have in our scene. But we may find that it doesn't even really help to smooth out our renders in a way that we want. And increasing the accuracy and increasing the photons are going to really start to increase our render time pretty significantly. So what we can do is to actually incorporate final gathering in addition to global illumination. So I'm just going to enable final gather and we can just leave it at the default settings. Now let's come back into our render view and let's save this off so that we can compare when we render with both final gathering and global illumination. And with the resulting render, if we zoom in here, we can see that we no longer have those noisy artifacts that we had previously. So this is before and then uh, this is after applying final gather. So our final gather rays were able to be cast into our scene and really helped to smooth out the global illumination photons. Now if you want to learn more about mixing some of Mental Ray's powerful rendering features to get great results in your own projects, I'd recommend checking out the Introduction to Mental Ray in Maya course.